Hello there, someone. <laughs> That's a really strange video that usually I don't make. But yeah, I'm doing the worst videos out there on the platform. And I'm here with another one. Probably you have seen some of my videos of uh, me unboxing stuff. It's really strange that I unbox stuff and never ever say anything about it ever again after I unbox it. That's the case today as well. I bought this new mouse. My mouse is currently this one. It's a really old mouse, it's from 2005. And I decided that I would change it to Logitech G502. This is not sponsored, but Logitech, you can reach out, send a message or two. I don't know what the process is, honestly. Today, we'll unbox that, that little baby. I I'll try to do it with my bare hands. Let's try to make it as hard as possible. We remove that sticky here. Boom. We're halfway there. Boom. Okay, what do we have in the box except the mouse? We have, this is not a sponsored video, I, I should mention that. This is, what is this? Some sort of menu, manual, but um, I don't know. Keep, it says keep playing, just believe me on that one. We have a Logitech sticker, uh, I think that's, I don't know what it is, it's a dumb logo. But if uh, Logitech reaches out, it's not a dumb logo anymore. And that's what we have in the beautiful box. We can go to the mouse. Which mouse looks gorgeous? Some of you might ask why I didn't choose a wireless mouse. Because I don't trust a wireless mouse. Imagine you're playing, for example, CSGO. A really dynamic game. And your mouse stops because it's not charged or something like that. And what are you doing? You say you charge them but you potentially lose a round because of that. And honestly, the cable is not a problem. What do we have actually in the box except the mouse? We have that little box right here. Yeah, that's a little box. And what do we have here? I'm gonna show you in a second. What else do we have? A menu. Who reads a menu? No one, exactly. We have another menu. Who reads a menu, as I said? No one. After we actually saw what is happening with the menus, this, this is the gorgeous mouse. Honestly, it feels really good. Actually, everything feels really good in comparison to my mouse currently. I don't know how long is the cable. So let's say that the cable is big enough. It's not small like my PP. What do we have in this box that I skipped? We have weights. At least I think so. I'm only guessing. We have weights. And these weights are for more professional players. I'm not that professional, but yeah, you remove the bottom, the bottom part of the mouse, like some somehow, somehow like. Mm. It, it it's actually pretty easy. Somehow, I don't want to break my mouse. Please send help. Yeah, you remove it and you put your weights here as long as i know this mouse has 11 pro program pro program pro don't laugh programmable buttons am i gonna use all of them at some point probably yes because i'm playing mmorpgs uh wow this is the only mmorpg that i'm playing this is my bish but let's go to the feature that i love about this mouse a normal ass crow right now like you see it's scrolling a little bit, but if you press that button right here, right here is the button, boom, and it start infinite scrolling. That's why I bought this mouse. Really, that's the reason I bought it. In reality, is it useful? No, but you can play with it a lot. And a reason I bought this mouse, there is no other reason. Yeah, exactly. I'm gonna turn it on really quickly just for you guys. Bloop. It started working right off the bat. The Logitech logo is lit up and we have... Wait, I started clicking shit. This is how the mouse looks. Yeah, that's it in general. That's uh, the Logitech G502. 
502 hero i wanted this mount mouse for a long time and it's a nice little upgrade to my current mouse which is like 15 years old so as i said at the beginning of the video will i make a review of the mouse definitely not i think it's a decent mouse anyway logitech you can send me an email as i said but anyway thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video